If we can get inside that thing, maybe we can do some damage. Doctor, they said you would try to stop me. Ah, uh, but I'm not. Stand away from the controls! She is. Too late, Doctor! The device has been activated. Immediate liftoff. Recall all Daleks! Now why are they pulling out? They must have activated the time destructor. That means we've only got a few minutes to live. A couple of the lads were inside that thing when it took off. Probably heading back to Skyro. I better get after them. I'm coming with you. I have to report back. Oh, splendid. Goodbye, Captain. I'll try and get the Colonel back safely. What do you mean, goodbye? I'm coming with you. You're sure? Yes, I'm not staying here. All right, then, let's get on with it. Never trust legends. They always let you down in the end. How will you find the Daleks? 
Well, that's the easy part. The Dalek ship is leaving a trail of emissions. Some of your troops must have damaged it before it took off. Do you really think your friends are still alive? I really don't know. Even if they're not, I still have to destroy their time machine, or the Daleks will spread their empire throughout all eternity. Scanners have identified the Doctor's time capsule. He is following the trail we are leaving for him. Excellent. The Doctor will follow us to Skaro. He will attempt to destroy our time machine, but we are prepared. The Doctor will be exterminated. I wish I knew what he was planning. Four day mission, Command said. It's been nearly ten. Garvik knows what he's doing. I hope. There's a ship coming into the Dalek base. Establish a base here. It's our job to destroy it. If the target is important enough, and if I judge the mission has a reasonable chance of success. What we really want to know is how much longer are we going to sit out in the open? Our supplies are down to virtually nothing, and the longer our ships are on the ground, the more likely it is we're going to be detected. They're adequately camouflaged, Jafet. As to our supplies, we'll, we'll live off the land. Live off the land? Scar is a radioactive desert. Even if there were anything to eat, it'd be suicide by slow poison. If we don't attack soon, we'll be too weak. We'll attack when I say so, and not before. Well, there it is. Your first alien world, Captain. The planet Skara. Welcome home, Kachel. Doesn't look up to much. The planet that spawned the most evil race in the cosmos. It's virtually abandoned now. Maybe we left centuries ago. We couldn't stand the radiation. Our decontaminant drugs became less effective with every generation. It's a dream to go back there one day, try to make the planet live again. And it's a dream worth holding on to. Not in my life. Well, all this eulogising isn't going to get anything done. What's our strategy? Well, I think we'll land away from the Dalek base and try and get in quietly. And the radiation? Take one of these every four hours. Oh, and try to swallow them quickly. They taste foul. Thank you. The command was talking about an attack on the Dalek base when I left on my mission. We may find some of my people. Oh, the more the merrier. They won't necessarily help. They'll have a mission of their own. It amounts to the same thing. Stop the Daleks. Shall we get on with it? Yes.
have brought back sufficient terranium to complete both the time travel and time destructor projects. A small device was detonated on the planet Earth. All indications of our presence were destroyed along with the human scientists who discovered the terranium. That is satisfactory. We also encountered the doctor. He eluded our attempt to capture him. We will lure him into a trap on the base. Do not fail this time. The Supreme Council does not accept failure. We cannot fail this time. We are using the Terranium as bait. The Doctor will be exterminated. Why do I get the feeling we're being watched? It's probably because somebody has been following us for about the last mile or so. How can you tell? A woman's intuition. Remain perfectly still. Told you. Stop all weapons. What about the rest of you? We haven't got any weapons to drop. I left mine on Earth. How did you get here? You brought us here on your ship. The only ship we've seen land is the Dalek ship. Why didn't we see yours? It's a time capsule, the TARDIS. And who's this then? The Doctor? Yes. We're wasting time. They're spying for the Daleks. I'm afraid you're right. No! Trafet! You nearly killed my sister, Commander! We can't afford to take chances. And sister or not, it doesn't explain what she's doing with these two. They're obviously not Thals. According to Kachel, I'm seen as some sort of legendary figure in your histories. Nevertheless, I am the Doctor, and I'm here for exactly the same reason as you. To stop the Daleks, and to rescue a friend who was trapped aboard their ship when it left Earth. I shouldn't worry about your friend now. If they're on the Dalek ship, they'd be dead. That might be the case, but we're not going to abandon them until we're certain. Very well. If you want to try, we'll help you get as far as the base. After that, you can look after yourselves. Thank you. Commander. Garvik. You better get in touch with Central Control. Before the Daleks left Earth, they were able to isolate enough terranium to power both their prototype time machine and the time destructor. One of the reasons we came here was to destroy it. If that's part of your mission, then I suggest we should combine forces. Are you a pilot, Kachel? Yes. Good. We have two serviceable ships, but only one pilot. You'll join him. You're not going to trust them, are you? You wanted to attack. Well, we may now have a chance. Besides, if the Daleks have the Terranium, they'll be close to completing their work. We might not get another chance. And you wanted to attack. Let's go. Control to perimeter patrols. Thal attack group has just passed outer defense perimeter. The doctor has been identified with them. Unit 9 will engage them at long range. You are ordered to inflict minimum casualties. The doctor must enter the base but not suspect a trap. All other Dalek units will maintain normal patrol patterns but avoid grid area 5-1. You. Don't worry about us. Get back and launch. Looks like we have to run for it. Can you move? I'm not a cripple. Why is it just sitting there? Who cares? Let's get the others covering fire. Go now. Our patrol reports that the Doctor and the Thals will arrive in the base imminently. The Thal forces were divided by the patrol. That is satisfactory. Order all units that the Doctor and his party are to be kept under observation. We will allow him to gain access to this area, but we will be ready to capture him if necessary. How much further is it? 
Another hour, I should think. Can't we radio for help? The Daleks are monitoring the frequencies. We have to maintain a communications blackout until we're making our attack. This is far too easy. We haven't seen a Dalek yet. They may be preoccupied with other things. It doesn't, doesn't matter. matter. We have the chance to do something. Let's not waste it. We need to find a control area. That's where the time destructor will be located. It's only a matter of time before they find us. Come on! Sister, I'm, I'm Captain Williams, United Nations. What's she talking about? It's a defence force on Earth. They've been fighting the Daleks too. That's where they're located another source of terranium. So it's true. The Daleks are building another time destructor. I'm afraid so. Garvik Barton and the Doctor went to try to get into the Dalek base. We got separated by a patrol. Did you say the Doctor? <laughs> yes, he really exists. Of course he exists. We didn't really believe he existed. It was just a story our parents told us when we were small. We don't have much time. Garvik said we should take off and make an attack run as soon as possible. He said you have a ship I could fly. Two fighters against everything the Daleks could throw at us. They're not good odds. Look, both your friends and mine are on the Dalek ship right now. I don't think our opinions matter that much, do you? You're right. Let's get going. Are you all right? If you're that concerned, I'll fly with you. These are two men, Craft. Is there anything I can do? You're sure? If you think everyone's going to go off and do something and leave me behind, you're very much mistaken. <laughs> all right. You're my weapons operator. Oh, right -o. <laughs> Don't worry, it's easy. You'll be fine. weapon just lying around for us to sabotage, I think. Drop your guns! You will take the doctor to the preparation chamber. At once. Your human friends have been enslaved. 
the task will be destroyed. You have failed, Doctor, and your knowledge and experience will help the Daleks take their rightful place as masters of the universe. You cannot fight the Daleks, Doctor. They are the supreme life form. You don't really believe that, Colonel. Why not? They have clearly defined their objectives. They evolve and invent their way past all difficulties. How many times have you tried to defeat them, but have you ever really hurt them? Their empire is expanding to stretch out to over a thousand worlds. You cannot win, Doctor. They will triumph sooner or later. And then, they will rule the cosmos. Are we in range yet? Passing over outer defence perimeter now. They're jamming the controls. Initiating countermeasures. Listen to me, Colonel. You are trained to resist brainwashing. It is your duty to fight it. Think! Remember your duty to the Earth. Your duty to your comrades. Captain Williams is here. She's fighting with the Thals. The Thals cannot win. That doesn't matter! What matters is that we keep fighting. We cannot allow the Daleks to enslave all the peoples of the universe without at least trying to stop them. As long as we are still fighting, there is still hope. You know that! Switch to full manual. Incoming fire. Taking evasive action. The prisoner is prepared. Yes. Don't I get a last request? In range, firing now! Direct hit! I can't see any damage! Jaffe, can you hear me? Just about. We're starting our run now! Stand by to fire! Let's hope the Garvik can still do something. The Thal attack was a failure. The Time Destructor is undamaged. The science area reports that there is damage to the mechanism of the time machine. We must assess the damage and report to the Supreme Dalek. Go on, Doctor. I wouldn't want to do that too often. I'm very glad you're a good shot. How do we destroy it? I'm not sure that I can. What? If we destroy this thing, it'll go up. It'll take us with it. Oddly enough, but well, whatever you do, you better do it quick. The Daleks won't be gone for long. Come on, Chapman. This isn't easy. Doctor deceived us. He 
time destructor. What is happening? There is a fault. The power is building up too quickly. Shut it down at once. Controls not responding. Power build up reaching overload. Order all units to evacuate. Too late! What's happening? We must have set off the time destructor before it's properly primed. Someone's moving down there. It's the Doctor and Colonel Harvey. Garvey and the others? Doctor, Colonel, you did it! By the skin of our teeth, with considerable help from one of your comrades, I'm sorry, the Daleks. They... It doesn't matter. We destroyed the Daleks. It does matter. They have no understanding of sacrifice. They exist as a hive. Alone, their lives are meaningless. And while we continue to value the lives of every individual and their rights, we can resist becoming the thing we aim to destroy. You won't forget them, Doctor. One day, your people will be able to live the life I've dreamt of by your forefathers and be able to renounce war. Now, that is a dream worth fighting for. Bit of a contradiction, isn't it, Doctor? The universe is full of them, Colonel. I think it's about time I got you and the Captain home. That's news I've heard all day. Oh, um, well, thank you all very much. <clears throat> Captain Williams, while I appreciate your loyalty, you can't just abandon unit like that. Next time anything like this... Next time, sir. I hope you're not planning on hitching a lift on every alien spacecraft that Unit encounters. I wasn't planning on making a habit of it. Well, then I won't need to abandon my post to rescue you, sir, will I? Do you mind if I say goodbye to the Doctor? Uh, not at all, no. He was in a bit of a hurry. Uh, please, follow me. Doctor, what's happened to you? The terranium. The radiation affects the way time works on the matter it contaminates. You saw what happened to the Dalek base. Well, now it's happening to me. Well, is there anything we can do? Nothing, I fear. Shell, I didn't realize you were... I wouldn't have... He's unconscious. I don't want to be callous, but if the doctor dies, does anyone here know how to fly this thing? 